Hey there, I'm Meg, and if you've ever intentionally or accidentally archived a message on your Facebook page and cannot find it, then this tutorial is for you. In this video, we're going to cover how to archive a message as well as how to find it and a few other classifications associated with Facebook messages. Let's get to it. So here we are on the back end of my Facebook page, and what we're going to do is head on over to Inbox. And we're brought to Meta Business Suite, which allows us to play with settings on both our Facebook page and Instagram profile if you connected your Instagram account to your Facebook page. If you have not, I have a tutorial on how to do that, which I will link to down below. So here is a quick little tour on where to find your messages. You're first going to be brought to all messages, which shows your messages from Facebook and Instagram. You can tell the difference between the two by looking at the logo next to the profile picture of the person who sent you the message. This is the Facebook Messenger icon, and the Instagram icon is the little camera logo that Instagram uses. If you want to just see your Facebook messages, you'll click on Messenger, and if you just want to see your Instagram messages, you'll click on Instagram. Now, if your Instagram account is connected to your Facebook page, you may have to do some extra verification and permissions to make sure that your Instagram messages go to your Facebook page. So my messages are not sending to my Facebook page in Meta Business Suite. So that's something I have to take care of later. Anyway, back to our main purpose. Here we see a Facebook message that I sent to my page earlier today. Now, first we're going to cover how to archive a message as well as a few other options. So in order to mar archive a message, you're going to click this little box, which to me looks like a beehive, and you're going to see it pops up as move to done. It used to say archive, and I think Facebook is moving away from the archive verbiage, so if you see archive disappear and you see move to done in its place it means the same thing the next option is mark as unread and then you have mark as follow-up which is for people who like to use the inbox zero method it gets the message out of your inbox and puts it in a different category so you know to follow up later there are also a couple of other options. If you click on the ellipsis on the main message you can mark the message as spam you can delete it completely, which means that you will never be able to access that message again. So archiving it is a better method because it gets the message out of your inbox, but you can still access it later. Delete means that the conversation is gone forever. Mark as follow-up is the same, and mark as unread is the same as what we just covered, as well as move to done. So let's say that you moved your message to any of those categories and now you cannot find it. What you do is you head on up to show filters and this is where all of your messages go. So they're pretty self-explanatory. But one thing I wanted to cover before I moved on is assigned. Assigned is something I'm still figuring out, but it seems pretty cool. The premise is that you can assign messages to the different admins associated with your Facebook page. So that's pretty snazzy. However, I have not figured out how to assign messages to admins. So if you have, let me know. So now what we're going to do is actually archive this message and then go and find it. So we're going to click on move to done and now the message disappears from our inbox. We're going to click on show filters. We're going to click on done. And this is where all of your archive messages will appear. I actually just did a recent purge and got rid of all of my Facebook messages, which is why you cannot see any here. But one thing I wanted to point out is that when you have a bunch of messages archived on desktop, you can't see all of them or I haven't found a way to see all of them. So for example, the last message that appears here, you cannot scroll down to get below that message. If anybody finds a way on how to do that, please let me know. But the only way that I've been able to find my messages below this point is to either delete a bunch of messages or unarchive them. 
This may be different on mobile and I will be creating a tutorial on how to access your archive messages on mobile. So hopefully that is a little workaround. Let's say that somebody sends you a Facebook message and you've already archived the message. So for example, let's say that I sent myself a message later on. The message bubble would then move from archive to the main message where we started out. You can also unarchive a message by clicking the unarchive button. In order to go back to your main message section, you're going to click the X next to done. And now we're in all messages again, there's no filters applied and here we can see our message. So that method works whether you are under follow up later or assigned conversation. If you click the X next to the filter, you'll be immediately brought back to all messages. Now, before we end this tutorial, I did want to point out that I do have an autoresponder set up here, and I also have a tutorial on how to set that up yourself, which I will link to down below. So that is how you archive and unarchive and classify messages on your Facebook page. I hope it helped. To learn even more tips and tricks, including how to get more likes on your Facebook page, what to post, how to boost engagement, and how to convert admirers into actual paying customers, check out my online mini course, Facebook Facelift. I've linked to it down below. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video.